In our town there is a tree that is very high. Here all the way up is Henrietta so high that also when she shouts very hard nobody hears her from down below and she is lonely. She hopes her best friend would come and get her. But she also knows that Ted can't know where she is. <gasps> Funny things, Ted, that I just had the most peculiar feeling about Henrietta. Well, if I just go and do my shopping. Yeah. Here is a playground for children, actually a place where Henrietta could have been left behind. Here she however isn't. But there are also other playgrounds. disturb you, sir. I am looking for Henrietta. She is white and about my oh. size. Huh? Do I look like someone would find you that is precious? I don't worry about you people at, at all. <gasps> I'd go there if I were you. In the mall, you buy yourself a new Henrietta. <gasps> the man is not a bad person. He just doesn't find teddy bears that are precious. Oh, he doesn't know what he's missing. <laughs> I don't know what has happened. I was sleeping 
As I woke up, I was here. A very rude person must have left me here. And now we are getting winter with rain and snow. Mr. Greenbow, I am looking for Henrietta. Believe she is stuck someplace. Why are you then going there? As a teddy bear, you never go into the woods. Have you ever seen a teddy bear in the forest? No, my point exactly. Because in the forest, you have no business to attend, my friend. Yeah, well, Mr. Greenbow. I'll be on my way now anyway, sister, and flies away. Hey, will the poor people? The Wildebows mostly enjoy chatting between each other only. And if they say something, it's a miracle if you understand. We just have needed some help. <coughs> Henrietta is there, you say. Can your word be trusted? And now he again keeps his mouth. Henrietta is now thinking, nobody knows where I am. How could they then come and get me? Choose a bit where to fall asleep because it might be that someone finds you that doesn't quite know where your home is. <laughs> 